When we started out with the design of the aqua tower, it was kind of buried within a, a cluster of tall buildings. From the highest floors, it's easy to see everything. But when you get down into the mid and lower levels of this high rise, it wasn't obvious how you would get views of these different landmarks. So we came up with the idea of, of creating kind of a, a topography on the outside of the building, uh, making the building into a landscape that would allow you to get out and around. And they were tied to specific landmarks in the city. We did that digitally through creating a, a city three-dimensional map. But we also did it in a kind of low-tech way too, to, to demonstrate to our client and to bring them into the conversation with, with strings that you could just see that there's a straight sight line between this hill on the building and then the landmark. It's a very simple and elegant design. It's really just concrete and glass. But the benefit is that the creation of these floor plates allows for very generous outdoor spaces and territories outside the apartment. When you're inside the apartment, you see this, it's almost like an extension of the space, the floor plane and the ceiling plane going right outside. Um, and makes the space feel bigger. When we developed this and through iterations, we realized the exterior spaces on the building are potentially great social spaces. Because the floors are changing from level to level, it actually allows you to see obliquely down to your neighbors, which you wouldn't get on a normal building that's repeated on floor to floor. So we started to really explore that, that social capacity of the balconies. The other big benefit that the balconies brought, the different shapes start to confuse the wind. It can't build up speed and it gets confused, which actually makes the balconies more comfortable as well for people to hang out on for a longer period of time.